Hello guys and welcome back to a brand new video here today upon my channel guys. Today my friends, we're going to be checking out a game on the mobile market which is called Standoff 2. I see as I've had a little go of uh, the game off camera, just have a little feel for it for the controls so just I know what buttons are what. But we're going to try and give you guys a proper video on this today and hopefully we can be able to... Give you guys a good one. But basically, the, what this game is, it's like a mobile version of Counter-Strike. That's literally what this game gives me, is Counter-Strike vibes. And I've just got absolutely wrecked there. But as it is, though, I just want to try and experience this. Hopefully, I could do a lot good at this game. I'll do pretty good at this game, hopefully. Because I've got a little bit of knowledge to Counter-Strike, believe it or not, in case you guys went away. When I was at school, I don't know if I ever told you this. When I used to be at school years ago, I mean, we're talking years ago. Um, I used to I used to play a little bit of Counter Strike on the PCs and stuff at school because back then, obviously, I didn't own a PC at home. It was just own consoles, and obviously, it was way before I did YouTube and stuff. So obviously, I wasn't the best at the game, but I used to play a little bit of it on my like break times and stuff. And I used to really love it. I used to think the game was absolutely awesome. So when I saw about this game, I was like, well. Mobile Counter-Strike. Can we do this? And I was thinking, yeah, we need to definitely play this. But at the moment, I'm being absolutely shredded. <laughs> but obviously, this is a free-to-play game as well, so you can download it and you can play it for yourself. And I'm pretty sure you guys will probably do a lot more better than me. Saying the least, anyway. Come on, Aaron. Three kill streaks so far. Been good so far, boys, and I'm just getting shredded. But if there is any other mobile games you would like me to try out on the channel, guys, whether it's just making a series on or just as like a one off video on, then just let me know down below in the comment section, okay? Because I'm open up for all suggestions and just want to try out new different things as well, just give you guys a different range in content. And I just thought, since obviously I can record mobile games and stuff, it's one of them things where I wanted to try it because. You know what I mean? Throughout the time to play YouTube, I play PC games, I play console games, I play betas and stuff, but I'm new to the whole playing mobile games as and making them into like into YouTube videos. So it's it's nice and it's a little bit something different, which I'm just hoping that you are enjoying here on the channel. Come on. Me shredded. Nice. Gotta be pinpoint accurate with these sorts of weapons, though. <sighs> Come on. Oh, my days. <laughs> I'm being destroyed, boys. I'm being destroyed. I'm still enjoying it though. I, th I think this game is pretty awesome. For a mobile game, it's it runs really smoothly as well. Oh my god. Uh, you can shoot for the walls and everything. Really, bro? You ain't gonna be doing that to me. Just saying. <laughs> you can literally shoot through the walls. You can proper wall bang him. That is mad. What the hell is life right now? Come on. Come at me, bro. My P90's just lethal. It's like a laser. Ooh, sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Trying to get wall banged, Aaron. Come on. <laughs> this is awesome. Honestly, this is really, really, really awesome. I don't know how you get other weapons, though. Do you have to, like, buy them, or... 
Can you earn them? I'm not too sure how you do it. Because I've I've seen other players using different sorts of guns and they're like, well, why have I only got this one gun? So I don't know if like you need to earn weapons or you have to level up to unlock weapons or something. I'm not too sure. If any of you guys out there know, then please let me know down below in the comment section. Because I don't really know at the time recording this. Like, I'm just... You know what I mean? I'm, I'm kind of oblivious to it. But when I saw this game, though, like I said, I was looking through some of the phone games that you can that you can play these days, like popular phone games, and I was like, ooh, look at this one. It caught my eye. So I thought, I thought first it was going to be like a normal multiplayer shooting game, and I was just like, instantly looking at it, thinking, oh, it reminds me of Counter-Strike. And I was like... And it just brought back a few old memories of like my school days in high school, just playing Counter Strike on the computers and stuff, in IT lessons and stuff. Which I used to be a little rebel at that. Like I used to not want to do my work and play, you know, play computer games all the time. It was just one of my things. But I see it as you know, we all do our, we all do this sort of thing in life. I'm pretty sure I'm not the only one guilty for it. I just saw a uh, money symbol pop up then. Do you reckon that's how you get weapons? Or do you reckon you can buy other things? Like attachments or something? Ooh, my days. That guy's got a really good height advantage on me over there. Oh, damn it. Fair play. Come on, boys. We can do this. It's a learning here for you. I can do this. I know I can. Just to keep practicing. <laughs> nice. That guy was absolutely oblivious and didn't know where I was then. Come on, bro. Standing in your spawn for. Don't want to be doing that. <laughs> Come on. Try catch him on the spawn, Aaron. I guess you could proper spawn trap him if you got the right sort of weapons in this game, but I don't think I could do it with the weapon I've got right now. I don't think the P90 is the best weapon to do it with. I'm guessing if you had things like a sniper rifle or a really good assault rifle or something, I reckon, you know, it's a little bit more doable. Or maybe even an LMG, because you've got loads of rounds in an LMG. But I don't think the P90 is the best sort of weapon to do, unless, of course, you're really skillful at this game. I do like the sort of, like, uh, maps they've got in this as well. Like, I remember on the practice games that I've had, basically, off-camera before I started recording this video, I saw one or two maps, and I was like, ooh, it looks pretty cool. So there's, like, a great range of maps in this game. But I see it is, I want to be able to try and give you guys, you know, some gameplay on different maps and stuff. Like, I'm not sure how long this video is going to be. I might even play a couple of games yet. I'm not too sure. But I see it is, I'm just hoping that you guys can, you know, that you're all enjoying gameplay on this and obviously if you are then all I ask guys is that you give these this video a big fat thumbs up and subscribe if you're new and if you would like more gameplay on this game of me using different weapons and stuff then just let me know down below in the comment section okay man this pistol's lethal look at this come on come at me bro this guy's camping by the wall <laughs> come at me bro I've got a pistol I ain't afraid to use it. Ooh, I'm getting shredded. I'm getting shredded. Where is it? Oh, you can even inspect your weapons as well. That is really cool. I like that. Come on. Where is everyone? Oh, they're all chilling in there, spawn. Because they know my team are pushing them. Oh, my days. I got shredded there. 
Never mind. It's good as well, because if you know the spawns as well, you can proper try and spawn trap them. It seems like you're only going to spawn in your area only. I mean, there's no, no like, great wide of different sort of spawn locations. It's just you're in your spawn area only. Just spaced out a little bit. Like, absolutely wrecked there. <sighs> Come on, team. 30 sec- well, less than 25 seconds left on the clock. Try to grab a few more kills. A few more cheekies. Come on. Nice. Nice. Damn it. <laughs> Trust him spawn behind me. Fair play. But there we go. I'm the most valuable player. Aaron Cooper for the most kills. Not complaining, boys. We went 40 kills. 40 kills and 13 deaths. We got the most kills in the whole game. Aaron Cooper, the newbie noob. On top four, my friends. That's what we're talking about right now. But pretty much, like I said, this game is practically just Counter-Strike Mobile. And I'll say, if you do like Counter-Strike, then I recommend just download it on your mobile device. It's free to play. Go onto your store, type in Standoff 2, and just download it. Give it a go. You never know. It might be your new mo new favorite mobile game. Who knows? But there's still a lot to learn. This Sanyards map, what we hopefully can go on to next. If we can go on this map, it really does remind me of a Counter-Strike Go map. It's something about the layout of it. I think it's this map, or it's another map, but it does remind me of a normal Counter-Strike, like, map that I've seen so many people play on. I think it is that map, though. I'm not 100% sure. There's one of them as, as this little dip path thing that goes through this, like, little doorway and takes you over to, like, it's like a sand sort of environment, and it really does remind me of a CSGO map. But I can't remember... The names of the map off by art, like literally, it's been years since I played Counter Strike Go. Which, obviously, speaking of the subject of Counter Strike, if you would like me to play some Counter Strike on the channel, let me know down below in the comment section. Maybe we can play and do pretty well with it. Who knows? Right, so I'm having a warm up game. Okay. Yeah, boy. Aaron Cooper with the laser P90. And I just got shredded. <laughs> oh, man. Nice. Match begins in just a moment. There we go. Wish me all the best of luck, boys. Nice cheeky little double kill there. Woo! Go for the triple. Come on. Man, this P90 is absolute savage. I love it. I do like this weapon, but I would like to try other weapons as well. It's one thing I would like to do. Damn it. Seen him though. He was camping in the corner. He's got the UMP 45. Fair play. Is he still hiding there in the corner? Yes, he is. He's camping away. I hate when people camp. Okay, don't, don't be camping, boys. Don't need to sit in little corners. You know what I mean? Move around a little bit. Ooh. Damn it, I'm not hitting anything. Pistol might be the better option if I want to be a little bit more pinpoint accurate with a weapon. But <laughs> I'm getting shreddy. That guy's got the fam ass. I'm gonna have to try and flank these guys, see if we can push into their spawn or something. And just try to sneak around them. That might be a better option to be honest. Give it a try. Ooh. 
Hello. I see you. Trying to flank me. Come on. By me, I meant my team. <laughs> That's what I meant. Didn't make any sense if I was flanking them, but never mind. I see you. Come on. Where are the enemies at? Who's there? Who's there? Who's there? Damn it. Fair play. Yo, check out this camo we had on his weapon then. That looked absolute beast. And obviously, you can purchase like camos and stuff in this game. Um, I think you can do it with obviously with real money. I'm not sure if there's anything like a currency in the game where you can earn them. I'm not too sure. But Asita's, for, for itself, I kind of like how this game works, like how it flows. It really flows really nicely. I have got like a camo for my pistol. You can earn these like little crate things, which you can earn um, in the game. So you can give you like camos and stuff from that, but I think you can pretty much purchase things from up the store if it says that, you know, you want to invest in the cosmetics in this game, but that's down to you. That, you know, I mean, that's your own choice if you choose to do that or not. Me personally, I prefer to earn things, but you know what I mean? People have different minds when it comes to this sort of game. Like, I know a lot of people who played a lot of Counter-Strike Go back in the past, and they invested so much money into different sorts of skins for weapons and stuff, which is a crazy amount of money, but I can't be a judge of that because I've spent ridiculous money on Call of Duty camos and stuff in the past. You know what I mean? Like, you guys have seen everything I had on Black Ops 4, and I spent too much money on that game just to find out a year later you can earn everything, which I'll admit, you know, it kind of really, really peed me off a little bit, but end of the day, it is what it is. And it's something I have to learn from. That's why when it comes to games like Modern Warfare and stuff, obviously when I'm making videos on that from my main channel, I didn't really, I've brought nothing other than the battle passes because if there becomes a ways of earning the content that's in the game, that are, not, that are on the store that you spend real money on, then by all means, I'll just earn everything. But I just don't want to fall into that little loop again, you know what I mean? Because look at Realm Royale, for example. Realm Royale's took in that sort of approach where... Hang on. It's took in that sort of approach where you can earn everything now. You don't have to spend money on things except for like an odd, odd item. But I've spent pretty much ridiculous amount of money on Realm Royale. But I don't regret it because at the end of the day, I enjoy the game. And I've, I've loved having every single skin I've got in the game to this date. But a seat is... You can earn all that now, pretty much. Which is, you know, kind of mad. <laughs> Come on. <clears throat> nice. Come on, we can get him. I think I'm doing all right so far, boys. Where is he? Where is he? Just gonna wait for him. Ooh, there's two of them there. And I got absolutely shredded there. I wasn't paying attention to where he was coming from. If I was trying to go for the two people at the top of the stairway, but it's one of them. Just didn't work out in my favor, unfortunately. Nice. Nice. Kill him. Nice. Keep killing them, boys. Thing is, as well, tap firing the weapons seems to be a little bit more accurate than holding down the fire button. So if you just tap it, it seems a little bit more better. Stop. <laughs> 
damn it, I just got absolutely rinsed there. Fair play. <laughs> uh, come on, save him, save him. Nice. We're winning though, boys. We're proper winning. Winning by about 20 kills so far. Which is so good. You know what I mean? I'm happy that we're winning these games. I don't want to be letting you guys down, okay? I want to be doing the best I possibly can. Even if I do look like a newbie noob doing it. Nice. Expected people to be around that corner then. Nice. Keep going, keep going. <laughs> We're gaining them, boys. We're gaining them. Ah, oh, you got me. <laughs> but man, this game is absolutely awesome. I really am enjoying this. I do want to, like, obviously experience other maps and stuff and, you know, try other weapons out and stuff. So if it's as you would like to see more videos on this game, like I've already mentioned, guys, then all I ask is that you give this video a big fat thumbs up and subscribe if you're new. If you have any tips for me if you play this game in general on, like, on your regular basis or anything, or if you are really good at this game you've got any tips to help me to get even better at the game, drop them in the comment section. And the seat is, by all means, if you would like more content on this game, subscribe if you're new. Turn on the post notification icon and notify you when I upload any new content in the nearby future, guys. And the seat is, I'll get round to making more content on this in the nearby future if you would like to see that. I want to be able to buy a weapon or something. Just want to let me do it. I'm sure that's what that dollar thing is, you can buy things. But we wouldn't let me interact with it then for some reason. Come on, come on. Damn it, <laughs> I just got rinsed. Ah, uh, come on. Okay, I've got 33 kills so far. Ain't too bad, we've got about 30 seconds left on the clock as well before the end of the game. Which we're definitely winning this game, boys. We're definitely winning it. Damn it, them spawns though. Mad. But there we go. The most valuable player, Aaron Cooper for the most kills. Loving it, boys. 35 kills and 15 deaths, which isn't too bad. And I've got the most kills. I'm happy with that. You know what I mean? I'm happy. Back-to-back -back games, the most valuable player. I can't complain. But like I said, if you want to see more content on this, then just let me know down below in the comment section, okay? Maybe I can get around to trying some sniping or something or some else, guys. It's all down to what you guys would like to see, okay? But like I said, download the game for yourself. If you want to experience this game for yourself, download it on your smartphone. Um, get off your app store, like obviously how you can get this game like on my phone that I've got as I can get this off my Play Store but you download it for yourself experience it see what you think of it and let me know if you're enjoying it and if you are enjoying the game and you've already been playing it on a regular basis yourself if you have any tips for me drop them in the comments section to help me get even better at the game I would really really appreciate it we've got a 2.25 KD ratio I can't complain with that that's pretty good you know what I mean maybe I can get it better one day who knows but like I said it's all down to you guys, okay? If you want to see more, let me know. Anyways, take care, have a marvellous day, and I'll see you again real soon. Goodbye for now.